Tell me you ain't looking at the eyes on my hat and thinking, whoop, swack. At the end of each year, how many times have you heard a person say, Girl, once this new year starts, I'm gonna be a whole new person. I'm gonna just change completely that nobody's gonna recognize me. That's a motherfucking promise. Man, at the start of next year, I'm gonna make the biggest change you ever gonna see. Everybody gonna know me. I'm gonna make my dreams come true, son. They're saying all these things, but nobody commits to it. I mean, yeah, there's some people that actually do what they were saying they were gonna do, but 99.9% .9 of y'all that just talk and talk and talk ain't doing shit. What you guys actually do commit to is at the end of each year just saying the same stuff all over again. But then this year starts and you don't do nothing. Let's throw in a couple examples. Man, this coming year, bro, this coming year, all you gonna see me do is be at the gym working on these muscles and getting rid of all this blubber, man. I'ma have abs, bro. Two months later. Hey, yeah, what up? I would like three extra large pizzas and an order of 20 boneless chicken wings. Yeah, and two Pepsi. Or the girl that says she's no longer gonna be around with players. Girl, this coming year, ain't no man gonna play me. Hey, I ain't just gonna let any man into my life. Uh-uh. No. I'ma pick me a nice dress businessman at Starbucks. No more of these club clown motherfuckers. I'ma choose me a good, clean guy that's gonna love me and marry me. Two months later. Oh, girl. I thought he loved me. He just left me this morning and he told me he's married and has three kids. <laughs> oh my god, girl. Well, where did you meet him? I was bartending at this strip club and he came in and I found him cute. <laughs> Whatever happened to the Starbucks clean businessman looking motherfucker? Or the dude that says that he's gonna live above the influence the coming year, he's gonna be clean as hell and no more drugs? Man, this coming year, I'm gonna quit everything. I'm gonna live above the influence, man. You ain't even ready. Two months later. Hey, hey, man. man dude, like, I, I, I need to, I, 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 I need to buy, I need to buy some stuff from you, man. I just can't, I, I can't live like this no more, man. Nah, man, you said you're gonna live above the influence. I can't, I can't sell you that no more, man. N nah, man, right when, when the new year started, I started doing it again, but you know, I got off it for a week right now, but I just can't do this right now, man. You need it. You, you. You got back on it a week into the new year? You couldn't at least wait it a month? Uh-uh, man, you really need to commit to cleaning yourself up. All these hoes out here talking about they're not gonna be hoes this coming year. Girl, I know this year I made a name for myself running around with all these dudes around this town, but uh, I am moving. I am starting fresh as hell in this new town. No more sleeping around with any random dude. Uh uh. No, I'm not even gonna sleep around with dudes at all, girl. Oh, uh, what are you doing tonight? <laughs> well, you know, it's New Year's Eve. I'm gonna try out the clubs here in this new town. Probably snatch me a dude to bring home, you know what I mean? Bitch, if you're bringing a guy home at 1159 December 31st, what makes you think you're gonna be clean as hell January 1st, 12.23 in the morning? You're gonna be sleeping with this guy, so you ain't committing to shit. Then there's the people that make the small changes. I'ma stop cheating on my boyfriend. Hey, you mind if I come over? No, of course I don't got no boyfriend. I'ma stop lying. Hey man, you coming to my show tonight? Oh, your show's tonight? Damn, dude, I'm at a doctor's appointment. I'ma be nice. Oh, bitch, you stink. People, if you're gonna make a big change this year, don't even waste your time telling everybody what you're gonna do. Just prove it to them by doing it. Because if I hear another motherfucker making a commitment, but yet they don't do nothing about it, I'ma beat the shit out of them with a spatula, with a dumbbell, with my head, with my fan that is right there, with my camera, with that big bouncy ball that I was gonna do exercise with, but I never did exercise with, with that filter thing that goes in the heater, with everything. Y'all ain't ready. Thank you guys for watching. Always means so much. Remember to share this video with your friends and your family and all these people that you hear saying all these dumb ass things. Hit that like button, drop a beautiful comment, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and it has been great being with you guys in 2011. You guys have been showing so much love. I love you. Have a great new year. Peace!